As the temperature drops across the area, the number of people at the area's largest family shelter goes up. The Salvation Army of Dane County has been running at full capacity for the past few weeks. That's where we find News 3's Christina Lurie. She joins us live to explain how they're able to serve so many people at once. Good morning, Christina. Good morning, Brittany and Adam. I've been here outside the Salvation Army shelter for just a few minutes at a time all morning long, and that is more than enough for me. I cannot imagine being out here for very much longer. That's why the Salvation Army shelter is working overtime to get as many people as possible off the streets and into a safe, warm place for the night. And they're anticipating another couple of busy nights ahead. Approximately 45 women, 55 kids, and 19 families at a time can stay at the Dane County shelter when it's running at full capacity, which it has been for the past two, much of the past two weeks. Winter is typically the most dangerous time of year for people who are homeless, but this winter has been especially brutal. The National Weather Service says that during the 11 day stretch running from December 24th until January 3rd. The average temperature in Madison was a mere 1.3 degrees. The Salvation Army provides not only a free place to stay, but everyone with a hot shower, breakfast, a snack and dinner, a toothbrush and toothpaste, and case management classes during the day to help people get out of the shelter and eventually into a home of their own. Because they provide all of this for free, they could use your help so they can help even more people supplies, um, just the essentials. Like I said, toothbrushes, toothpaste. We go through a lot of that. Towels, blankets, um, pillows. I always say pillows shouldn't be washed as many times as they do. We go through a lot of pillows. People like clean pillows. If you can help out, the shelter director asks that you donate the basics like a toothbrush or toothpaste, clean pillowcases, stuff like that to this shelter. Again, you can bring those donations here to the Salvation Army Shelter. It's located just east of downtown Madison on Washington Avenue on the 600 block, and you can drop those donations off at any time. They'd be very welcomed. Such an important resource. Thanks so much, Christina, reporting live for us this morning.